the mainstay of the treatment of metastatic colorectal cancer to liver is surgery, but chemotherapy does make a little bit of difference, and um, the only study really that shows some benefit is a study, again, that's a perioptive chemotherapy study before and after surgery. Uh, Bevacizumab is very interesting. Uh, uh, we have studied it um, in, in great detail at our institution um, uh, because uh, it, first it can be given to everybody, but it does produce a nice pathologic response, uh, which in our opinion is a very meaningful response uh, to uh, uh, treatment. If you look at the metastasis, the, they uh, become fibrotic, and 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 you could uh, uh, correlate uh, uh, this um, um, change um, with, in fact, survival. Uh, so the, the you can measure the uh, percentage of viable cell within the, the metastasis. And importantly. Uh, you can correlate this pathologic response with radiologic response, which is even more interesting because then uh, you have patients who do not necessarily go to surgery. And, and what you will see, the correlation uh, with this uh, major response uh, translates in a um, um, loss of enhancement in the lesion, so they become dark. They become very well defined, we call this type 1 major morphologic response, and it correlates with survival uh, in patients resected having surgery, but also in patients who have uh, advanced metastatic disease, not only uh, liver disease, and, uh, and it translates in the survival uh, that's extended from a median of 19 months to 31 months.